Hello friends of inspiring Catholic youths, welcome back to your very own channel. Today we are going to look at something to do with prayer and that is Lectio Divina. My dear brother and sister, have you ever heard about the word Lectio Divina? Do you know the process or the processes involved? In the Lectio Divina today stay with me and I will let you know about the Lectio Divina how we can do it and how we can pray using this method of Lectio Divina there are very many methods that we can use to pray to communicate to God and also to listen to God. Now, Lexio Divina is one of the methods that we can use to communicate to God. My dear youths, stay with me, listen, and understand how you can communicate to God using this method of prayer, the Lexio Divina. Also called divine reading. It is a way to connect with God's word through prayer. Well, it sometimes it is sometimes described as reading scripture with the ear of the heart. Lectio Divina is a process of reading, reflecting, responding, and resting in a peace of the scripture. Well, a little bit about the history of Lectio Divina. Lectio Divina, this method of prayer, was founded by Benedict, Saint Benedict, and Pope Gregory. It was widely used in the 6th century, though its roots are dated back way in the third century. This was then used in monasteries for a long period of time. But now, this method of prayer is being used all over the world by Catholics and by Protestants as well. Some of you are already asking yourselves, how can I pray using this method of prayer? Do not worry. We are going to look at how the, diff the process of praying using the Lectio Divina. Getting ready to use this method of prayer, you have to find a comfortable place where you can sit or be in a posture of prayer. After Get your mind set. Get in the mood of prayer by relaxing and let your mind, body, and soul feel at peace. Then invite the Holy Spirit to accompany you as you start this kind of prayer. Then choose a verse from the Bible. Read slowly by slowly, slowly by slowly, listening with the ear of the heart. Read several times, first time, the second time, the third. If you want, you can even go to the fourth as you wish. Number two, reflect on the word. Meditate. On the words of God and then listen to your heart what word or phrase or sentence recalls much to you which word speaks to you much number three respond to the word or phrase that speaks much to you and so repeat it 
several times in your heart or if you want verbally repeat it several times and then offer it in prayer to God number four rest in God sit in silence and listen to how God communicates in that very phrase that has caught your heart Thank you very much. We have come to the end of this session. Dear youth, a friend of Catholic youth, in this channel, we bring you different things. We bring about the Catholic church, the Catholic values, the Catholic customs and traditions, prayer life, and many different things. Therefore, let us know what you want us to bring you about the Catholic Church. Continue to like our channel, subscribe, and continue to update yourself using this, using this very channel that is your very own. Otherwise, thank you very, very much, friends of Catholic youth. We love you and ciao.